What's up, Castle Clash? This is Haley's World, and I'm here today to bring you some HBM action. Just want to show you the power of Multanica and Ares in HBM. Ares has literally turned HBMJ into a walk in the park now. Barely using any garrison, just the uh, a couple purple garrisons of uh, the couple legendary heroes that I'm leveling up. And that's it. Nothing else. No longer using any green garrison at all. And uh, it's just been ridiculously easy. So, here we go. Watch those two monsters in action. Just the fact that Ares targets only heroes and he stops them from proccing is just huge. Because that's the main thing you have to avoid in HBMJ is you just have to survive Spirit Mage's proc and a little bit you have to survive Thunder God's proc if he just decides to go off on your heroes for some reason. Stopping that is just tremendous. Like look at that Spirit Mage just getting eaten alive by by that Ares proc right there, just eaten alive. And there's J2, no trouble. Oh, this is the only way I could lose. A split. Spirit Mage goes off just with Ninja. What a joke. There's gonna be multiple Spirit Mage procs now over there. Maybe, I don't know, maybe I can still get through. If I still get through after a split, that's really good, because usually a split spells doom. Wow, look at, see that Ares proc? Take that, took that mage out. He was over there causing me trouble. And it took him out. And now I get a good spawn on J4. Just got to survive that revite mage and get some druid heals going here. Come on, druid, let's do a little bit of healing. There we go. Let's get another heal, Druid. One more heal. Nice. And look at that. Going into J5, Druid is all the way revited up. And so is Ares. So Ares is going to open right with a proc. He's going to proc right on their heroes. Hopefully he targets that Spirit Mage, and he does target the Spirit Mage right off the bat. And look at that, Ares still going to work over there. He'll he'll lose to the, he'll die to those dragons, but that doesn't matter because once they walk over there, Multanica's revited up, ready to take out the whole wave if necessary. Although he won't need to. Druid and Minotaur will finish it off for him. And that's the closest run I've had in my last eight HBMJ runs. And that was with that horrific split that happened. And I still handily beat it, even with that horrible split. And there you go, 55 shards, 519,000 experience. Always a nice thing. So there you go, there's the power of Ares and Multanica and HBM. Just unstoppable. Alright, hope you enjoyed this uh, quick HBM video. Please like and subscribe. Haley's World out.